Here we are at the Rosevale Mine in New Brunswick. And we're with full crew today. So the boys are getting ready to go in the mouth. Beautiful little adit here by the, uh, the riverside. Just up the hill into the cliff. Allegedly not a super deep one. Uh, said to be anywhere from 80 to 100 feet. But uh, we're going to take a venture in and see what we find. Okay, here's the rock face just outside the uh, the mouth of the adit. The boys have already headed in there to take a little peek ahead of me. Like I say, there's the uh, the riverbed down there. And uh, yeah. Oh, there's ice. So we'll uh, we'll open up the camera here and get the lights going and take a peek. Let's head in. All right, we've got the lights out. Camera set properly. We're heading in. So. It is May 2016 at this point, and uh, I guess cold enough in the mine that there's still some ice possible to stay frozen, as you can see right there. Kind of like our own little mini glacier here at the mouth. Uh, there is some uh, continued drainage out of the hill as things are thawing here in the spring. But a beautiful little adit. We'll have to go over that uh, ice. All right, there's looking back at the mouth where we came in. And as you can see, we have passed the, the ice. But just giving you a point of view of what it looks like. This is in approximately 40 feet or so. And if we turn around, the boys are down here. There's a right turn here. Oh, at a probably the 60, 70 foot mark. And it goes uh, just here into a little alcove. They decided to stop, I guess. But it does continue. There's been people in here. There is a Sprite or 7-Up bottle on the floor. And it's on quite a curve. Is it still going? Oh, this is the end. Oh, this is the end, okay. There's the end, folks. Some random debris on the floor and shit. Beautiful little mine. Okay, he's heading back. We'll take a walk backwards here. So this, this mine is sort of question mark shaped. It came in straight and then started taking a, a curve and didn't stop curving. And there he is getting over the, uh, the little glacier. Don't slip. Okay, we're back to the mouth. He's already out into the river. Let's take one last look. There was some uh, some structures over near where we parked. Let's go. And just uh, one of the first things you see when you come in here to park on the old road here by the river, there is some old uh, mining foundations, like so.
some sort of uh, structure here that looks like it was bashed into because it was hollow. Well, there's in there. Don't know what that might have been used for. Here's the outside of that structure we just looked inside. And if you look up on top, there are ore cart tracks sticking out of it. So it looks like ore carts actually drove onto the roof of this thing. There's some jutting out in this direction as well. But as we know, it could be used as a reinforcement for the concrete, because we saw that back in Montague, the way they used to use the old rails and just uh, stick them into the concrete and pour around them. And that was your rebar. So who knows? So that ends our visit to the Little Roseville Mine, the Little Roseville Mine at it here in New Brunswick. So farewell, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.